I've got 18 so far. Let's see if they'll let me use this all the way up to 20. Well, I, I doubt it, but we'll see if it works. Thanks. Here's a piece of eight for your trouble. Just one more try. And if they do it, I would be very surprised. 19 and... Thanks. I'd give you a piece of eight, but uh, <laughs> I'm fresh out. Of course. Of course, it stops right at 19. All he had was 20 on him, so it looks like we're going to have to do something a little bit more creative. I have something in mind. Use... Uh, oh, that's right. I can just left click. Use the stick with the I string. I think I'm too clumsy to hold the stick and tie a knot at the same time. Use the squiggles with the string. That doesn't seem to work. Hmm. Okay. Use the stick. Uh, no... Let's, let's get a little creative since he ran out of stuff. Let's go ahead and open up this box. And then use the stick with the box. There we go. Then we can use the string with the stick. And we can use the cheese squiggles with the string. That doesn't seem to work. Uh, no. We'll put the cheese squigglies with the box. And then we shall walk away and pull the string. Ah, I'm stealing your rat. Open the box. And get the rat. And I've got an art for taking out the rat. I'll look at all the art at once when we are when we are close to done, I think. Or even done. That should be fine. After we have finished it all. Oh! Are you happy that I... Mad Marty? Mad Marty, are you happy that I got I rid of him? I made Lurgle leave this island. You made cards out of sand. That's Do I even, care? That's not even close. Oops. I thought I wanted to talk to you, but I don't. Are you guys happy? I did it! Yoo-hoo! Now they don't want to talk to me. Nobody is happy for what I have done. I have ended the one-man gang on the island, and nobody seems to care. Fine, we'll talk to the ship. See if he's happy that he can now rent his only room anymore. There's a frog. I can't do anything with the frog. Oh, that's right. He's out chasing the eater of cheese squigglies. He's eating the, the little biter. All right, so let's head into the hatch. Uh, no. Well, yeah, we'll talk to the guy at the hatch first, because that's not actually how we can... Did we already talk to him about getting the job? We'll do it again if we haven't. Or if we have, if they let me. Excuse me. Yeah, boy? Largo the Grand has left Scab Island for good. You're welcome. Well, well, I guess all those laxatives I was slipping into his drinks finally got to him. What? Don't worry, I don't put him in all the drinks. Really? Is that job available? Is that job available yet? Sorry, that guy I hired is doing just fine so far. Fine. Nice place you have here. Well, see ya. So let's see why I went through all that trouble to get. I am out of cheese squigglies, but I do have a rat. Cute little fella. Is he? Is he really? Don't say that, actually. I know what we need to do with him. Do you guys know what we're going to be doing with the rat? Let's go into the window. See if we can't sabotage this guy in the back here. Mr. I chop potatoes really well, I guess. We're gonna sabotage him. Good thing this is a cold soup. So now we need to exit out the window and head down into the front entrance. Be like, I hate the soup. This is awful. I think that's how we do it. Excuse me. Yeah, boy? Yes, how is the stew? Hey, uh, how's the stew tonight? Stew? Oh, gosh. We only serve gourmet chilled soups here. It's In fact, so our new cook has been working all day on a very special Vichy Soise. Let me go see how he's doing. Is it normally chilled? I only thought Gaspacho was chilled. How's the Vichy Soise, Bernard? Excellent, sir. Won't you have a taste? Oh, I think I will. It's very good. Oh, my 
God! What kind of demented recipe book are you using? <laughs> You're fired! But, sir... Out! Get out of my sight! I feel bad, but... This is the most disgusting, filthy mess I've ever seen in my life! I need Look the job. all the hair! <laughs> and what's this stuff? How am I ever gonna get rid of this junk? You don't plan on serving that, do you? Just dump the whole well, thing out. here's your soap! Oh! Uh, I'm really not that hungry anymore. Yeah. Dang! Hey, can you cook? A little. How'd you like a career in the fast-paced world of pub food cuisine? Are you saying there's an opening in the kitchen? Yeah. You interested? Sure! Yeah, wait, how much does it pay? I don't know. How much does it pay? 420 pieces of eight a week. First week paid in advance. Oh, I will need that paid in advance right now, please. Sure, I'll give it a shot. Great. Job is yours. Here's a week's worth of wages. Now go strap on that apron and get to work. I'm, go I'm going to make the best beef consomme that you have ever had in your life. Vichyssoise avec rat hairs. Uh, that means with, by the way. Vichyssoise with rat hairs. If you couldn't figure that out. I don't really feel like working today, though. would be mad if I left work early. We're gonna do it anyway. Like, I care. Let's just get out of here. And I do have my money. And a monocle. Which surely is useful for something more than teasing the cartographer because he can't see anymore. How you doing, Blandy? Who uses a monocle, really? Who has per who has good eyesight in one eye and needs something in the other eye? Actually, I work for an optometrist, so I could tell you the percentage. It's not high. Uh, we'll just get out of here, head to the peninsula, and talk to Captain Dredd. That was not Jamaican. I don't know what that was. I don't do Jamaican very well, man. So into the houseboat, through the winding path we go, and hopefully we can talk to Captain Dredd, and he is happy with all the money that we have. What do I have now? 439. Damn pirate didn't have that 420. Otherwise, this would have been fine. Well, actually, no, I got 420. Dread, I think you're laughing. Get me out of here. again. So I see. What can I do for you this time, Mon? Get me out of here, man. Mon. I can't do it. I can't do it. Give me the ship. I need to charter a ship. I can't charter you my ship because I lost my lucky eye that has seen the world sailing necklace. I have it. Uh, I can't just... I gotta run. Lots of treasure hunting to do. Okay. Bye, Mon. Come again. No, back inside. So I can't even do it from here? I can't just do it from the context of the menu. I give the monocle to Captain Dredd. Would you like my monocle? Thanks, Mon. This'll do just fine for me lucky sailing necklace. Yeah, you figured. What can you? I do for ya? Need to charter a ship. I need to charter a ship. You're in luck, my friend. Rumor has it that Lago's been run off the island. So I'm now free to sail again. Only problem is... You're welcome. ...that you don't look like the type that has 20 pieces of eight. Are you serious? Actually, I do have that much. Well, man, consider me ship chartered. Great. Where's your ship? You're standing in it, man. Yikes. And we are moving on to part two. Four map pieces. Hooray! Part one complete and I got an achievement. Sweet. I'm not aiming for a chance. Deep in the Caribbean, hidden by an endless storm, lies Lechuk's Fortress. When did he get a fortress? What the hell is going on here? So, when are we gonna resurrect the old bloated fool? Oops. He doesn't I'll look too well. Ignore that comment just this one time, Largo. I love his Only voice because they tell me you found Guybrush Threepwood. Three. It's Threepwood. Damn right. And I found him on Scab Island. Very good. No one gets the upper hand on the Chuck without getting what he deserves. I want Guybrush brought to me, and I want him brought alive. I am entrusting this to you. Do not fail me. Never, your voodoo lordship. Aye. Guybrush Threepwood is finished. I need you to start building me a very special doll. Uh-oh. With 
pleasure. I don't like this guy at all. I'm off to find Big Whoop. Yay, we're still finding Big Whoop. We don't really care about LeChuck, I guess. So, let's take a look at our ship. Very nice ship that we have here. One parrot shell. It has a picture of a parrot on the front. Thank you, I couldn't have figured that out by myself. Welcome to the Jolly Rasta. Where do you want to go? Uh, what are my choices? I don't know. What are my choices? I only know how to get to Tree Islands, man. What are they? There's where we just came from, Scab Island. Of course. The only island where pirates are free to be pirates. Then there's Booty Island. I like the sound of that festive place. Festive French Mardi Gras party all the time island. Let's it's retire. run by one of the most respected and loved governors around, Governor Elaine Marley. Wait, what? Elaine? And last, there is Fat Island, a fascist dictatorship run by an over-bloated pig named Governor Fat. Here, take this easy-to-read reference map, courtesy of Dread Tours. You can use it to show me where you want to go. Ah, sweet. So we do have, like, choices here. Can I actually cancel this? I don't think I can. Uh, actually, we, I, as much as I love the sound of Booty Island, let's go to, to Fat Island for now. And, oh my god. You know what this reminds me of? This reminds me so much of a game that I used to play as a kid. Yeah, we, we have to go around the narwhal. Oh, look, then they moved the narwhal. No, the narwhal lives in the middle here. I don't, I don't have a pointer I can't show you. And this is the long way to, to Fat Island. This reminds me of a game that I used to play back in, when I was a kid. I don't think it'd be good for Let's Playing, so I probably won't do it. But uh, I used to play Where in the World is Carmen San Diego all the time. I love that game. It, it's, yeah, it's not that great for Let's Play, so I probably will, will avoid it. To be honest, though, I need that parrot challenge. That's why I wanted to cancel it. Can I get back on the ship? Uh oh. Excuse me, sir. I have a beard. Yes? Aren't you Guybrush Threepwood? Uh. What? Uh, yes, I'm proud of it. That's right. I'm the man who swashed the ghost pirate LeChuck's buckles. I'm sure that's a very interesting. Seriously. Hold on. No. No, we got it. We got this. Ding story. But we don't have time for that now. You'd better come with me. Governor Fat would like a word with you. Uh, no, let's do this later. I'm really very busy. Could we do this another time? Coming. <laughs> Fine, I guess we'll do it. Looks like we don't have much of a choice. This is not looking too well for us. Mm, oh. oh, excuse me. Oh, that well, was gross. Mr. Threepwood, I can't tell you how pleased I am to have you here as my guest. Um. Yeah, let's 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 bore him to death. Would you like to hear the story of the time I blew LeChuck's top? <laughs> Funny you should mention LeChuck, as he's the reason I brought you here. Ah, uh, you wanted to thank me for getting rid of him, huh? You're well, welcome. No thanks are necessary. You see, I... Perhaps you didn't kill him quite so thoroughly as you imagined. He looked perfectly healthy the last time I saw him. Wait, what? Last time you saw him? Oh no, but Chuck's back. Oh, I gross. beg your pardon, did you say something? I can definitely do this again. Now, just tell me where I can find him. He doesn't scare me. Just tell me where I can find him. I rather think he'll find you, Mr. Threepwood. You see, he's put a sizable bounty on your head. Oh? A bounty I intend to collect. Oh. Uh... <laughs> it does buy a lot of bacon grease and pure fat. That sounds tasty, actually. I guess that bounty would buy a lot of bacon grease and pure fat, huh? Why, you... You can figure it out while you wait in jail for LeChuck to pick you up. Take him away. Yes, sir, Governor Fat. No! Come on, you little weasel. This isn't it? Uh, um... Uh, where do I want to put the emphasis here? 
How does Schwarzenegger do it? I'll be back. That just just the normal then. He didn't put emphasis on anything. I'll be back. That that is Come not on. even close though. How dare you? Don't try to escape or anything. Walt will chew you to bits. Is this Walt? Okay, Walt. I'll be back to relieve you at eleven. This reminds me so much of the Pirates of the Caribbean right at Disneyland. How you doing, Walt? And it looks like we are in jail once again. And as a result, that is going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Monkey Island 2, The Chuck's Revenge. Special edition. I've been Baller Scoob. I've been joined, as always, by the repeated felon, Guybrush Threepwood. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.